Who the fuck is this? Son, get back to the ranch, and I'll explain everything. And I mean everything. Can't you just tell me now? I guess not. Hey, Carl. Hey, what the fuck, man? Hey, Torino, I, I told you my bad, man. What the hell can I say? I screwed you up. Calm down, kid. Just go ahead and kill me then. Calm down. Man, you ain't number the fucking Yale dealer anyway, Torino. Shut up and sit down. What, you think I'm a drug dealer? And you think you're a crusader for good? Do you have any idea what's going on? Any idea whatsoever? Do you? Do you? Nah, I pay as little attention to things as possible. Do not be a fucking smart ass with me. I work for a government agency. It is not important which one. I will try not to confuse you. Yes, when we last met, I was involved in battling threats in Latin America by any means necessary. That does not make me a drug dealer. Now, the money that we raised, the friends that we won over, have helped us immeasurably in our overseas interests. Government agency? Kids like you, you expect heroes. We're fighting a war out there. I'll be a hero and I'll lose. And what do we have? Communism in Ohio. People sharing. Nobody buying stuff. That kind of bullshit. So relax and listen. All right, all right. I'm listening. I know what kind of guy you are. I need a guy like you. To do things I can't get caught doing. Like what? I need you to commandeer a truck. A rival agency with a confused social agenda. They got things that we need. Now, this is a two-man job. You'll need a friend. Use your sister's boyfriend, but don't tell him a thing. Remember, I'll be watching you. I got here as fast as I could, CJ. Yeah, you sure did. How you know I needed help? <laughs> Man, you losing it, Holmes. You phoned me a half hour ago. I did? I mean, oh, yeah, I did. Sorry, man, I got a whole lot on my mind. Get out of my face. We need to jack a truck on the freeway. It's headed to San Fierro. We can get on the freeway here, Holmes. What's the plan? I'm gonna pull alongside, and you gonna hop aboard. Oh, shit, you didn't mention that on the phones. It'll be a walk in the park. Tell Kendall I love her. There's a rig up ahead. Keep level, CJ, keep level. What do you think? I'm a Mexican jumping bean closer! Keep level, CJ! Keep level! Just a little closer, Holmes! Keep level, CJ! Keep level! Speed up, CJ! Speed up, CJ!
tables are turned now, boy! Asshole. Help me. Roger that, big monkey. I got a 13-6 fat vulture. Need to acquire a drowning baby. Over. What? In 15 by the fat moon. Break your heart. Over and out. Carl, I need you to do me a favor. Yeah, I'll do you a proper injury, man. What you knowing about my brother? <laughs> Relax. He's in prison upstate. D-wing, cell 13. To the left, I got a child killer who wants to rip his throat out. To the right of him, I got a white supremacist who wants to eat his heart, to be precise. Now, don't worry. Tenpenny and Pulaski are really relatively benign, unless, of course, you're a family member of Officer Pendleberry, whom they shot when he threatened to expose them. But you do know all about that, right? <laughs> Dang! Hey, man, how you know all this stuff, man? And won't you stop it? You just don't understand, do you, kid? It's all white knights and heroes. We have to make decisions, kid. You know, I try to set bad people on other bad people, and sometimes I let good guys die. He's your brother, but to me, he's just collateral. It's a very delicate decision. Over here, you got all the scumbags inside the country. And over here, you got all the scumbags outside the country. And me and my colleagues, where the fucking pivot? Keep the government in work. Which reminds me, come here, okay? I need you to head over here in the buggy outside, okay? Okay, let off a flare. We got some precious cargo needs collected. Hey, hold up. What about my brother and all that shit you was talking hey, about? Hey, don't worry. Sweet's just fine. He gets touched. A prison guard goes home and finds that his wife and kid have been murdered. Everything's under control. We'll talk later. Now, come on, get out of here.
Marino, where you at? Miles away. No time for niceties, kid. Choose a vehicle, grab the equipment I provided, get to that drop zone, and wait for that package. Will you stop doing that? giving me the heebie-jeebies, man. Carl, I will always be watching, or listening, or both. Hey, 
You ain't scaring me, and you ain't stopping me. Head to a 1024 in North Bone County. Suspect left me in a dark pickup. It's amazing. What's up now, Torino? This history, it's all lies. It says Hitler killed himself, and then we nuked Japan. And people believe this shit. <laughs> Jesus. Well, it'll make them sleep better at night, I guess. Hey, man, what did you want? Is you gonna free my brother? No. Not now. And here's a little news flash. I said that to get you to do something for me. Man, you real fucked up. But the shocker is, we are gonna look after him. Because I need him alive as much as you do. Oh, thanks. You know, after what you've done for me, it's like you're a pro now. I got double agents in Panama. I want to put a price on your head. A Russian spy. A little fat Boris-looking guy. He's asking for clearance to interrogate you. Russian style. Calipers on the genitals. Feels good. You'd like it. That ain't nothing cool, man. Just leave me alone. You bad news. Don't worry about it. The Russians got bigger things to worry about than your genitals, believe me. The whole country went to shit. You know, we tried hard to put a lid on it, but that idiot Gorbachev with his little strawberry in his forehead, he gave away the crown jewels. Still, they got their, you know, their boy in the White House. That was nice. So? What you want me to do? Now listen, I need you to buy me some property, okay? Shouldn't cost that much. You offer them a dollar. If they give you a hard time, kill them. I'm gonna need you to start doing some real wet work here for me soon, okay? Enough of this little girl bullshit. Now get out of here. Come on, beat it. So what do you think of our new base of operations? It's missing something. Maybe a tennis court and a pool will help motivate me better. Very nice call, very cute. Uh, so listen, now, <clears throat> you're gonna have to learn how to fly. No, I ain't. Yes, actually you are. I set out a series of tests for you. You can access them on that TV. You're gonna have to prove to me that you can fly if you're gonna continue working towards your brother's freedom. Shit, whatever, man. Very nice. 